blueprint for higher education and as I mentioned her speech is very much related to uh, the first shift which talks about producing um, holistic uh, balance and uh, entrepreneurial uh, students but when we talk about the cheery entrepreneurship then you find that it's definitely um, to do with um, voluntarism as well now I'm flagging off this one is the first one to be read right to Sarawak but um, this program has been extended to throughout uh, the, the whole of Malaysia and not only at the national level but has gone on to the ASEAN level as well and that's why you find four students, two from Laos and two from uh, Vietnam are coming uh, to join in this particular program. And there are lots of values in this type of program as I mentioned just now. It's not about only the activities that they carry out that they get a lot of lessons, uh, you know, in terms of instilling the values of cooperation, values of tolerance, working together as a team, uh, discipline, and also at the same time to feel the need of the people where they will come in to help. And uh, Dato Juraida, who is the uh, chairman of uh, YSS, Yasan uh, Sukarno uh, Siswa, um, has done a very, very good job in the sense that all together I think we have produced about 400. 465 students, leaders, leaders, student leaders, and um, what we intend to see is the impact on the students themselves, whereby if there's a need for volunteer work, they are ready to come up without asking for anything in return. I think that's really very, very important. And you see it, the excitement reflected uh, in the faces of the students, they're so excited. They know it's going to be tough because they're not going to the cities, they're going to the rural areas that need a lot of help. So I think, um, again, in my speech I mentioned that this is very much related to T and 50, uh, which is being uh, the aspiration of our PM. And definitely you'll find that whatever we are doing, we are doing it relevant in terms of development.